The Evil series finale is approaching, and with the latest episodes of the Paramount Plus series proving that it's going all out, it seems likely that there could be some casualties along the way. Evil creators, Robert and Michelle King, have promised that the final episodes will provide closure for the main characters. That said, some fan-favorite characters might not make it through alive. As Paramount Plus has cancelled Evil, everything is on the table, and no one can truly be safe. Evil Season 4 has already shown it's not afraid to kill off beloved characters, with Cheryl, Christine Lottie, getting murdered in Episode 10. This is likely just a taste of what's to come in the upcoming episodes that will answer the question about the evil coming to New York. Given the show will soon wrap up, some characters are more likely to get a happy ending than others. Although Sister Andrea might be a little too one-note for some viewers, the demon-hunting nun has proven to be a widely loved character. If the Kings decide to do an evil spin-off series at some point, Sister Andrea would be a good option. But this could become a moot point though if the nun doesn't make it out of the evil finale alive. While it's less likely that the church's frequently forgotten nun faces the chopping block, she's still an outside chance of dying in the evil series finale. In a recent interview with Screen Rant, Martin hinted at a terrifying demon in Evil Season 4 that will appear in one of the last two episodes. The reason why Martin remembers the scene as challenging may also be hinting at her possible death. As she's unsure if this demon is in the last or second-to-last episode, it implies that she survives to the finale, but that doesn't mean she makes it out alive. Evil killing off one of Kristen's, Katia Herber's, daughters is not outside the realm of possibility. Over the past two seasons, there's been a lot of interest focused on Lexus and how she's tied to the grand evil plan. Then, in season 4, episode 11, Ellie, Anna Klumsky, appears, who claims to be Laura, Lexus' sister from the future. Ellie told Lynn, Brooklyn Shuck, of a frightening future, saying, when Lexus is 35, and Timothy is 23, he will bring about a battle that will destroy the world. Whether Ellie is legitimately Laura from the future or not, there's still a chance that Lexus is sacrificed in some way. There are a lot of dark forces pointing at her, including Leland, Michael Emerson, who has long been convinced that Lexus will be the ambassador to the Antichrist Timothy. So, of the Bouchard daughters, Lexus seems the most likely to meet her doom, but if she does, it would be more likely to be in a future form, perhaps as herself at 35. Although Grace has only appeared in a few episodes, she's been an important part of evil. Her prophecies have been crucial to the church and in finding out more about evils the sixty and demonic houses in the Codex, and a vision of her protected David, Mike Coulter, when he was hospitalized. It's unclear whether Grace will return for the series finale episodes, but it would make sense for her to come back to finish her work. Grace may already be on borrowed time. She was almost assassinated when she drew the location of where Andy was being kept in Leland's apartment, and although the prophetess had foreseen her own murder, she believed she would die that night. So, if Grace were to return, she would be a massive target for evil to come after her, and she would likely have important information that would help the good side prevail. This is why if she were to return for the final episodes of Evil, she would be a candidate for getting killed, but also probably sainted.